Today I'll be playing Matt Mania Exciting Hour. Created by Technos in 1985 and brought to your living room by Hamster's Arcade Archives for the PS4, Matt Mania challenges the idea of what's considered exciting. The object of the game is to pin down your opponent for 3 seconds. If you win, you get to move on to the next match. There are 5 different challengers. Beat Golden Hulk and you become champion. You can continue to compete until you lose. And there's about a dozen different moves you can use to lower the other guy's energy, ranging from the basic punch or kick to pile drivers and tosses. You have two attack buttons, labeled strong and weak, that are defaulted to X and circle respectively, which are actually mislabeled in the instructions, so be aware. You can also dash by pressing both buttons together. If you go into the game mashing buttons, you're going to be disappointed because your challenger totally punishes kicks and cooldowns. The most reliable method if you want to win is to punch and move up and down the ring. Get him into a headlock, pile drive, and take some free hits off the corner post. It's really cheap, but any other technique will get your ass handed to you. Once I learned this strategy, the matches went from frustratingly difficult to overly basic and easy. The game looks alright for 1985, but I really wish they could have changed up their rings with each match. And why is Darth Vader in the audience? The referee looks like he has an extra chromosome, and hearing him count is probably the most entertaining part of this whole ordeal. Overall, Matt Mania Exciting Hour isn't exciting, and I doubt anyone could play this for more than an hour. There's also a two-player mode, but it's alternating, so you can't even go at it with one of your buddies. Did anyone here download the game thinking they were going to be able to play it with somebody? Did you wind up playing with yourself? How did that turn out?